I've been a landscape photographer for the past eight years. And despite having the best camera bodies and lenses, I found that having a really good computer is super important for keeping up with you and your photography workflow, which is exactly why this Microsoft Surface Pro 11 powered by Snapdragon X Elite comes in. My name is a project photography and in this past week, I was in Mammoth shooting some incredible landscape photography and it gave me an amazing chance to go ahead and test out this computer. So I'm gonna give you guys the full review on it for photographers. And we need to start with the battery life because I've had computers before that did not have the best battery life and it made it so much more difficult to edit my photos in a productive and efficient way. Because the lack of battery life forced me to sit next to an outlet constantly and especially when I want to be more portable and lightweight, Having a computer where you had to sit next to an outlet made it even less portable because you couldn't just bring it anywhere. Which is why I'm so happy the Snapdragon X Elite processor is super power efficient and gives you multi-day battery life. This is especially nice when I want to go to places and edit my photos and not have to worry about my computer dying on me anytime soon. This allows me to edit much larger projects on the go and be more lightweight and portable. Because especially when I'm out there shooting landscape photography, I'm not always going to have an outlet next to me. So being able to trust this computer and know this can survive through an entire trip is so amazing. And one aspect I love about the Surface Pro in particular is the fact that we have a touchscreen and a pen. And normally you wouldn't think this is super useful for photography, but I've actually found it to be incredibly intuitive and a really great integration with the PC itself. So when it comes to using the pen, I love this because you're able to adjust those sliders a little bit more accurately than you would with something like a keyboard. You can also use it as a brush when you're in Photoshop or even in Lightroom when you want to brush out certain objects and having that pen, it feels just much more like an actual pencil versus having to use your mouse or your keyboard. And even in an application like Lightroom, being able to just click on the stuff that I want to erase when I'm using the erase tool is really nice, especially when you have that pen. It's a far more intuitive workflow and makes editing more fun and easier to do because now you have this other input method that just makes it so much easier to adjust the different points that you want to adjust. But especially zooming in and out on something like Photoshop is far, far easier because if you guys know, when you're using Photoshop, it's a little bit more difficult to zoom in and out, especially with a trackpad, but being able to just touch it is just much more intuitive overall. And having things like the pen and the touchscreen performance is really nice, but it's not good enough if we don't have good performance. Good thing for us, Snapdragon X Elite processor has us covered. Because it comes with a 12 core CPU and because it's a more integrated chip, it's way faster when it comes to its power. It's incredibly fast and responsive when moving around the UI. And when you make those adjustments, there is zero lag between you actually making that adjustment and it showing up in your photo app. And when I'm editing, this is huge because I don't have to worry about it lagging or saying, okay, let's make that adjustment and make sure it looks good, but then having to wait forever for it to actually make that adjustment. We don't get any issues here, especially with the Snapdragon X Elite processor. And especially for a photographer like me, who's been doing this for the past eight years, it's really nice to know that I can just make that adjustment and not have to worry about my computer taking forever, which overall decreases the time that it takes for me to imagine how I want to edit something and how it appears on my screen. I can do that instantaneously and it's such a huge advantage. And even for small things that you wouldn't think would make a big difference, like how long it takes to boot up Lightroom and Photoshop, it makes so opening those applications incredibly fast and makes getting into your workflow so much easier. It's just another barrier to entry that is taken away that makes it so much easier to go in and actually edit your photos. And as a landscape photographer, I'm creating a ton of HDRs and panoramas and focus stacking all of which require a much more intensive editing process. And luckily for me with the Snapdragon X Elite processor, I can go ahead, throw those photos into Lightroom, click merge, and it turns them out very fast. Having a computer with this much power in it makes it so much easier to get through my workflow because I know it'll be fast and efficient and that's the last thing I'm gonna have to worry about. And with the Snapdragon X Elite processor, we have access to a neural processing unit, which allows us for better AI capabilities. And with this computer in particular comes Copilot Plus. I do use it when I wanna look up certain tutorials. If there's something I don't know on Photoshop and Lightroom how to do, I simply look it up and it gives me a really detailed response as to different options I have available to me. And the best part is that this feature is right on this keyboard. There's a button for it, so you easily have access to the AI feature whenever you want it. Having a computer being this small and powerful is so amazing because I can't tell you how many times throughout my photography career where I've had a computer simply die on me because battery life sucked 
or the performance just wasn't up to par and made loading these programs impossible, that's not a fun situation to be in, and which is why I love the Snapdragon X Elite processor in here. It's integrated into my workflow really well and made it really easy to edit my images in a blink of an eye. And especially with all day battery life, this just makes it such an easy computer to bring around. And for me, when I'm out there on those landscape locations, I can bring this out and edit the photos on the go without having to worry about it taking up too much space or weighing me down. So if you're interested in a computer like this, feel free to check out Snapdragon's website down in the description bar below. What kind of photography do you do? Let me know down in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for experiencing the world with me today. 